Hello, right, this is one that's been on the list for a long time and we need to get this done this year. Um, I'm sick of looking at it, it's cluttering up the yard and we need to get it down to the burrito site. So we've just got to finish this off, get some windows in this side and the door on and I'm going to put some solar up on the roof for a watering system. We need to get the tomatoes in there and the coriander in there for the burritos. So this is today's little job. So this is a little bit of an insight to how I do projects. <laughs> so this is everything that's come out of this. Out of here. And basically what I do is, if I don't get a chance to finish stuff, I just chuck everything that might be relevant to the builds. So there's obviously plant pots and stuff there. Some bits of wood here. A door that's sort of vaguely the right size. Some glass. And all sorts of other bits and pieces and we've got a tank on here and I just chuck it all in the general direction of this and then when we get a chance we crack on and get it done I've had this caravan chassis for ages and it's about time we just knocked this one out really and got it out because we need to get some tomatoes growing but it'd be cool Big man's on the chop saw. I've just got to sort these bow in the sides out and put some uh, more strength in the sides. So we're going to use some of this uh, off cut chip lap that we've got laid about. I don't really want to spend any money on this, this is all just stuff we've got left laid about. But it should just fit in these corners quite nicely. windows or truck windows of some description that just so happens to fit the gap Yeah, certain well. A bit more of this today. Problem with me is I do seem to get myself, I have spates of not a lot to do and then suddenly 50 things to do. So we're trying to fit this in between all the other projects and all the other stuff and I'm trying to do it for nothing. So hopefully we can just get the most the majority of this done today. There we go, wonky hard, that's me. Um, I'm gonna leave that there on the back of this. I, uh, the trouble with me is I keep, I'll keep going and going and going and going and then we end up
end up with putting about a million hours of work into it and it isn't that sort of thing this isn't that sort of build it's just tidying up a bit of rubbish in the yard and, and making us a usable space so that's about it on the back okay time's running out a little bit for the fancy stuff so i'm going to get the door on put the benches back in um and at least we can get it down to the site and then the solar panels and all the rest of the bits will have to come later but um door first so we just had to take these hinges off because the doors they're on the wrong side basically for the door to open up so took these off um, and because we're trying to do this at a very limited budget we're just going to reuse these screw them on the other side Okay, doors on. I'll just chuck this bench in there. thing is just to get some use out of it um, we can refine it I need to put the solar on the roof there's lots of bits and pieces I need to do but just for now we need to get stuff in here and get growing and then we can worry about all the details afterwards it's only a rough old thing this um that I've done but it's another thing out of the yard another thing that's going to get a bit of use and it's something for nothing you know this has cost me probably 10 quids worth of screws and nuts and the odd bit of glass and bits of stuff like that so it's been laying around long enough okay thanks for watching take care and uh, catch us on the next one